Bagpipes Operation ID. FBI reports over 5 million various thefts a year. Google search of bagpipes stolen lists thefts from across the country. Here are a few that I found listed. Suggested actions before loss occurs will be discussed in a moment, but first, your bagpipes are missing. What do you do next? Report your missing or stolen property to the local police, the law enforcement agency where the loss occurred. You'll need to report the circumstance of the theft, a full description, a unique description is best, and the full dollar value if you want your property listed in NCIC, the National Crime Information Computer. Every state has its own laws concerning the recovery of stolen or lost property. Note that many states allow pawn shops or secondhand dealers to hold on to disputed property until a case is resolved in court. A recovery case. A few years ago, a backpiper was traveling through a local city. His vehicle was burglarized and his backpipe case with backpipes was taken. The city's police department pawn shop detail found where a known vehicle burglar had pawned a set of backpipes for $25. In the backpipe case was observed a tartan cloth, a school name, and a school nameplate. These items assisted law enforcement officers in locating the backpipe's owner. The items also aided in identifying the backpipes as his. To begin with, photograph your backpipes without cover, bag cover, on a neutral gray background with a scale. Also photograph your bagpipe case showing any anything unique about it in this case the little braided cord also photograph the interior of a bagpipe case showing its contents you can use a uv marking pen wood burning pen or permanent marker to mark your property as you see fit bluetooth and GPS trackers are also commercially available and can be secreted in your bagpipe case or in, even inside the bag of your bagpipes. Synthetic DNA marking microdots are also commercially available and uh, are not visible to the unaided eye. They can be placed anywhere on your instrument. Also, inside of your uh, synthetic bags, uh, manufacturers uh, list uh, information. This is also a place where you can list your own information. Record that. Also, you, in this case, a, the base drone stock was uh, uh, engraved with a number unique by the owner. Bagpipe property sheet being described in the next slides are available for download from the USPA resource page. Remember, you are identifying your bagpipes to someone who knows nothing about your instrument. So be detailed as possible. The front page is also where you list your serial number or manufacturer's identify number. The back page is where you will list unique characteristics to your bagpipes. A sample will follow discussing some of the elements that you would consider putting on this sheet. Of course, the front page you're going to say whether it's a full size, three quarter size, and you're going to describe the, the material that the bagpipe's made out of, including a serial number or identifying mark you added. The back page, you'll list unique characteristics of each component. Do you have uh, two tenors and a bass, or do you have a tenor, a baritone, and a bass? Any missing or defective parts? Any missing parts? You've done everything to protect your investment. Complete the backpack property sheet. Save copies of the sheet where you can get to it. Email it to yourself along with your photos and save to your cloud account. A copy of the backpack property sheet is available for download from the USPA resource page. Remember to update your photos and property sheet as needed.